Well, well, what do we have here? Another bunch of wannabes? Excuse me, sir. I think there's been a mistake. I know this is Spec Saturday School, but um, I don't think I belong here. It is now 8.32. You have exactly four hours and 28 minutes to think about why you're here at Spec Saturday School. You may not talk. You may not move from your seats. And you may not touch any of the equipment. All right, people, we're going to try something a little bit different here. You're going to write me in a thousand word essay describing why you should be here at Specs Saturday School. Is this going to count towards our final grade? Wake up, people. Newsflash nobody is going to hire a bunch of lazy rejects. This business is all about the scoots. Do I make myself clear? Crystal. Good. Maybe you'll learn a little something about the TV biz. Maybe you'll even decide whether or not you care to return. You know, I can answer that right now, and that'd be a yes for me, sir, because... Sit down, Johnson! Thank you, sir. My office is right across the hall. Any monkey business is ill-advised. Any questions? Yeah, does John Stamos know you stole his haircut? I'll give you the answer to that question, Mr. Fender, next Saturday. It's you mess with the bowl. You'll get the horns. I've got my eyes on you. Trip. Hey, I've seen you before, Mr. Schwarzenegger. Packing up food for the rest of us? Hey, man, cut it out. Don't touch my food. If I lose my temper, you're totaled, man. Totally? Totally. Why can't you just shut up? Nobody here is interested. Really? I can't even believe I'm here right now. Um, what did everyone do to get put in here? Wouldn't you like to know? None of your business, dude. Okay. Jennifer, what about you? I was late to class like 17 times already because I was in the bathroom doing my hair and makeup. I don't see anything wrong with it. Looking good is everything. Okay. Um, Dane, is that your name? What did you do? I broke a DVC pro camera in a fit of rage. What made you so mad? Well, some jerk stole my muscle milk. Okay, since we're all sharing, why don't you tell us why you're here and why you're wearing guy liner? Well, I brought a bunch of razors with me to cut the film, and apparently there's a new method to all this editing. There's computer software stuff, and they, they thought I was bringing them as weapons. You mean to tell me that you thought we were going to literally be cutting film in editing class? Yeah, and to answer your guy liner question, Fender, I believe in freedom of expression. Whatever, dude, I'm just saying. Some people might get confused. You don't think I'm pretty, do you? Leave him alone, man. All right, we gotta get to work. We're never getting out of this school or this day alive. What about you up there, little missy? You haven't made a peep this whole time. What are you in here for? I, I, um, came to the school to come out of my shell, but when I got to Sherlock's class, I messed up big time. Ow. When it was my turn to be the weather anchor, my classmates tossed it to me and I froze up. I bet the director loved you for that. Shut up and let her talk. Anyway, after standing on a live camera shot for at least 60 seconds, they decided to cut to the next story. Sherlock told me not to come back until I can produce a, a quality live shot. Ouch. Yeah, so I think I might have failed. You think? I'm getting out of here. You can't leave. Mr. Warren said so. Leave my shorts, Pete Wentz. Hey, you're really making me mad. You know that? What are you gonna do? Throw a camera at me? Okay, Fender. Since you're so cool, why are you spending your Saturday here? Huh? Because I want to. I'm so sure. Why did you even come to the school in the first place? You obviously aren't interested in learning anything. And you obviously aren't in interested in doing anything but your hair. Why, it looks nice today. How long did it take? I know it does. And how long it took or anything pertaining to me is none of your business. I want to be an anchor. These people are delusional. 
okay. She can be whatever she wants to be. I want to be a major film editor. Well, you better stock up on razors. Will you seriously just shut up already? Why I don't listen. And let me guess, a sports reporter? And he could go all the way! Woo! So, you know, I'm more than just a jack. Right, just like Emily's more than an AV dork. And Jennifer's more than a stuck-up diva Pris. And Ryan is just an emo kid whose daddy doesn't love him. Who are you trying to kid, buddy? You're just like me. And not. Prove it. Fine. Jeez, I really wonder what he did to get stuck in Spec Saturday School. Beats me. I think it's kind of funny that he won't say. <laughs> yeah. I know what he did. What did he do? He stepped in front of a shot during another class production and got into it with our teacher. Really? Yeah, I'm in that class. Huh. Shouldn't he know by now that's the best way to get yelled at and get stuck in there? <laughs> yeah, it almost sounds like he did it on purpose. You guys are still here. Well, yeah, because unlike you, we want to get a job and actually get out of this school. Who said that doesn't mean I want it? Well, I don't know. I heard about your little cameo, and I, I guess you already got a job now, don't you, Fender? Whatever, man. I needed the smoke, and they were in my way. <laughs> Who cares? Stop trying to act all hard. Why don't you even come to this school if all you care about are your smoke breaks? If you must know, I came to be a news writer. Finally, a serious answer. I said I'd prove I'm not what you think I am. So here, I produce. What is that? It's our essay. Well, Bender, thank you. Don't thank me yet. Read it. What's it say?